In this video, I am going to show you how to install WordPress locally on your PC or laptop using MAMP. Go to MAMP.info. The website user interface will look like this. Click on free download and select the operating system. I am selecting Windows and the download has started. The size of the file is 683 MB. Currently the download is going on. In the meanwhile, I would like to download WordPress. Go to WordPress.org and select uh, download and extend. The current version of WordPress is 6.2.2 at the time of recording this video. For you, it might be a different version. Click on download WordPress. Once you have downloaded both MAMP and WordPress, go to the location where you have downloaded these files. First, let's install MAMP. Right click on MAMP and click on run as administrator. I would like to go through the setup process without changing any settings. Click on next, next, next. Accept the terms and conditions. Click on next. You click on install. Currently, MAMP installation is going on. Once the installation is done, click on finish and open MAMP. Here is application. Give the access. Click on allow access. The user interface of MAMP will look like this. Currently, both the Apache server and MySQL server is running. If you want to stop uh, the server, simply click on stop. The servers will be stopped. If you want to start the servers again, simply click on start servers. Uh, the Apache and MySQL servers will be started. If you want to access the local host, simply click on open web start page. On the browser, local host will be shown like this, local host forward slash map. From here, you can access the PHP admin also. Under tools, click on PHP admin. It will open the PHP admin user interface. It will show you the list of databases you currently have under PHP admin. And also you can create a new database. Click on databases and if you want to create a new database, simply give the name. For demonstration purpose, I have given the name as Navic. You can give any name and after that, simply click on create. It will create a new database. From the left side menu, you can see the new database which you have recently created. Now to install the WordPress locally on your PC or laptop, open the file explorer. Click on this PC. Under local disk C, you will have MAMP folder. Click on MAMP. Under MAMP, you will have lot of folders. Under that, you need to open htdocs folder. Click on open. Under htdocs, you can create a folders and you can place WordPress files or any other CMS files. Here is the WordPress zip file which I have downloaded. Right click on that and extract it. Click on extract all. Currently, the extraction is going on. Once you have extracted the folder, open the folder. These are the inside contents. I would like to copy this uh, folder in htdocs. So open htdocs and paste this folder under htdocs. If you want, you can change the name of the folder also. I generally give the folder name as my project name. For demonstration purpose, I have given the name as Nivek. You can give any name. Now to access that folder, WordPress folder, what you can do is you need to type localhost forward slash the folder name. In my case, it's Nivek. Hit enter. Here you can see that it is showing the WordPress installation. Select the language, click on continue and click on let's go. Previously we have created the database. I'm going to give the name of the database. If you haven't created the database, you can simply open PHMM admin and click on database tab and give the name and click on create. And after that, uh, give the name of your database and type the username. Generally the username is root. I would like to keep the password as blank and generally the database host is localhost and if you want to change the table prefix you can do that. Otherwise if you don't want to change anything you can simply leave this field. Click on submit. If everything goes perfectly you will get this message. Alright Sparky. Click on run the installation. Give the name of the website. You can give any name. You need to give the username. This username and password will be useful uh, to log into the backend of your website. If you are giving weak password, you need to select this box, confirm use of weak password and you need to give your email ID. And after that, simply click on install WordPress. And here you can see the message success uh, WordPress has been installed. Click on login and enter the username and password to log into the backend that is administrator. Here you can see that the backend of WordPress looks like this. If you want to access the front end, simply click on visit site. This is how the front end of your WordPress website looks like this. As I said, the URL will be a localhost forward slash the folder name. I have given the name as Nivik, so I have typed Nivik. If you have given any other name, you need to type localhost forward slash the folder name. So that's it guys. In this way, you can install WordPress locally using MAMP on your PC or laptop. Hope you like this video. Please do subscribe to our channel. Thank you.